Ariel? You're not sick, are you? Are you here to see the nurse? She just stepped out, but I can help. What's the matter? Is it serious? No, just a little embarrassing. I'm gonna be a doctor. There's nothing you can't tell me. Well, I was practicing my debate speech, and I guess I got a little excited. What happened? I fell off the stage and skinned my knee. Boy, preparing to be president of the United States is dangerous. But don't worry, because I'll have you fixed up in no time. Sit. Okay, I'm going to make sure the wound is clean now. Dry it up with a gauze pad, pop on a bandage, and voila! All done. Now your body will repair itself within a few days. Boy, you are good. Thanks, Gabriel. Now, I just had to make a note of what I used. I'm helping the nurse keep track of how many cleaning wipes, gauze pads, and bandages are in the drawers. Want to help? Sure. These are the cleaning wipes. The nurse started with 659 of them in the drawer and has used 238. If we subtract, we'll know how many are in the drawer now. Oh, I get it. Let's expand the numbers to help us subtract. We do that by breaking them up into hundreds, tens, and ones. 659 expands to 600 plus 50 plus 9. And 238 expands to 200 plus 30 plus 8. Now let's subtract them. First we subtract the ones. 9 ones minus 8 ones is… 1 1. Now the tens place. 5 tens minus 3 tens is 2 tens. That's 20. Right you. And 6 hundreds minus 2 hundreds is 4 hundreds. Put it all together and we have… 400 plus 20 plus 1. Which is the same as… 421. Now, let's do the gauze pads. Okay, but I know a different strategy. It's called the grid method. <gasps> oh, I know that one too. Here, you can use this. The nurse started with 725 gauze pads, and she used 302. So, if we subtract 302 from 725, we'll know how many are in the drawer. In the top row, we need a 7 in the hundreds place, a 2 in the tens place, and a 5 in the ones place. Right! Now we need to subtract 302 from that. So in the row below, we need a 3 in the hundred place, a 0 in the tens place, and a 2 in the ones place. Now let's subtract. Start with the ones. Five ones take away two ones leaves three ones. Now the tens. Take away zero tens from two tens, and we still have two tens. And seven hundreds take away three hundreds leaves four hundreds. So our answer is four hundreds, two tens, and three ones. So there's 423 gauze pads left. Good work, Gabriel. And speaking of work, isn't it time you got back to it? Yep. Thanks, Dr. Deb. Maybe take an extra one, just in case. I'm just rehearsing my speech. What could possibly happen? Whoa! Yep, maybe that's a good idea.